women, women, if you're born a woman, you are the problem of this world, I tell you. Because trust me, nobody cares about you like that. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to my channel. It's a sad, 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 sad. I'm just mad. <sighs> you see, eh? Women, women, if you're born a woman, you are the problem of this world, I tell you. If you are born a woman, you are the problem of this world, yes. Um, <clears throat> the fact that you are a woman and society just expects so much of you, I don't know who that society is. Tell me, is it our fellow women that we say society or it is men who we say society or a mixture of both? Because trust me, nobody cares about you like that. Okay? People are just interested in giving them something to talk about for a few hours, a few days. Move on to the next topic or trending issue. So... For you to be a woman and to be able to survive or be in this world, you should actually know who you are and what you want in this life. You are a creation of God. God created you in his own image to be what a light to the world, to come and fulfill your purpose and destiny in this world. And you come and succumb to some kind of rubbish called a union, rubbish called society, rubbish called family. And you miss out in being yourself, enjoying yourself. I just heard of the sad news of a gospel minister in Nigeria who passed on. And the allegations are that it was due to domestic abuse. Like, really? Why would you sit down for any other person who is not confident and have trust issues, self-esteem issues, or just issues in general to pour that on you in the form of abuse and you sit down and take it in? Now you are dead. Are you okay? The man who is allegedly to be abusing you or who have been abusing you will move on to another person. And sadly, another woman will come and sit in that marriage and endure that abuse in the name of keeping a certain status of being married or making a home, keeping a family together. Really. What kind of children are we raising to become the adult of today? Melo Keke has been saying that, that raise your children well, raise your boy child well to become a good husband. But seriously, what kind of children are we raising, both male and female, that another person's son, another woman's son, somebody's son, will come and abuse somebody's daughter it can be physical mental emotional whatever a form of abuse it is a no 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 that you should allow somebody to do to you or be encouraging it in the name of oh i'm a minister what will people say the bible does not encourage divorce my children are young <laughs> he would change let's pray he would change sadly he changed you if only it's true i just blame women i blame women fellow people fellow women fellow ministers fellow pastors lady pastors are coming out and passing all kinds of commentary on the fact that oh 
She confided in me, da, 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 da. She said, blah, 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 blah. And I canceled that, da, da, da. Uh, because I wanted to keep it confidential because she asked me to. I could not come out to say it. But she has been suffering, blah, 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 all this while. And you, now you are not coming out to say it. What benefit is it now? What benefit is it now that you are coming to say it? When the person was alive, the person confided in you. What did you do? Did you ask your husband? Did you ask fellow ministers of God, fellow people who could talk to this man? Who could give this man the kind of help he needs? Who could give this woman the help she needs by breaking out of that marriage? I'm seeking the kind of separation or just being away or something. Did you speak out generally? about it please we can do better as women we can do better as wives we can do better as mothers at least raise our children well to have self-love if you love yourself so much you have that same love for other people If you are a happy individual, if you are not bruised, if you are you you are if you are emotionally whole, if you are mentally whole as a human being, you would not want to abuse anybody. Inferior, low self-esteem people who have issues are the ones who want to just abuse others to feel good 